when I decided to quit my job in the docks in Simonstown and paint for three months at least, I spoke with a friend of mine about my decision uh, and he said to me, why don't you just go away from Simonstown for a while? Go to the country. So I went to the country, a little place in the country called Caledon, which is in a wheat growing area um, and where, where people have uh, sheep and cattle and so on. So I went to, to this village called Tessasdal, which is about 50 miles out of Caledon. And I, I, my decision was to go and spend three months in this village. But uh, subsequently I went every year in the latter part of the 1950s to this village because I, 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 I would take my sketchbooks and my paint and my writing material and I would spend time, a lot of time walking, sketching, uh, making notes of things, walking with shepherds and their sheep, getting acquainted with not only the people but the landscape as well. Again, I, I found it a very interesting period because uh, of my interest in space. And there was a lot of space in this particular part of the country. And what was also interesting about it was the fact that there were all these different patches of wheat growing and shrubbery and so on. And the road that seemed to wind through the landscape and so on. So I enjoyed the experience a great deal. Um, but this painting was not actually painted on the spot. I had a sketch in a sketchbook and this was actually painted a few years after the sketch was done. It is called October Landscape because this is what the landscape actually looks like in the month of October. It is a beautiful landscape. I'm talking about the landscape itself, not the painting, but it is a beautiful part of the country to be in.